Welcome to Early Room Tutorials. Today, I'll be showing you how to import images at a, at a sprite image. We'll be adding on to our animations more. We're to first, we'll create an image by going to Microsoft Paint. But when, most Windows computers already have this pre-installed. And now in here, we're going to a corner. And we're going to create some dots. Now we're going to use, once they're finished, we're going to add this into our animation. So I have a couple of dots, make them kind of random, like this. And then we're going to select rectangular selection. We're going to highlight, we're going to select the dots created, and then crop. That'll crop it down to just the dots. Now we're going to File, Save As, and then we're going to name it. We're going to add this to Documents. Actually, we're going to go back to Desktop. And put in our pivot animator folder. I'm going to create a new folder and call this animation resources. We're going to open it and then click save. Now we can exit out of Microsoft Paint. Let's go back to the beginning of the animation. Now you can go to file. And then a load sprite image. Sprite images are pictures that you can add to your animation. Then you go to animation resources, and click on the particles, click open. Now we'll just have particles, so you can put this over or under wherever you want. So we're going to delete this for now by clicking delete figures. And it'll ask you if you'd like to delete it from your list of figures. You're going to click no. Now we're going to go to somewhere where we want to add this sprite image. I think we're going to add it right here. We're going to go to add figures. And here you can see all the different figures we have in the animation. We'll click on particles. we X out. I'm going to move this over. Now we're going to grab the red dot and size it with the Alt. You can also use Control. So I'm going to put it here. Control C to copy. Control V to paste. Now I'm going to, do it to flip it around so it looks like he's kicking up dust when he's running. And then you can keep going through the animation. I'm going to add it here. And then have him, and then when the character gets hit, we're going to have some as in like a hit effect when he gets hit. Have some when this when the character lands. And then keep going until when the character falls, hits the ground. And you can add this wherever you want or with any type of image. And you don't have, and if you don't want to, you don't have to add it. Sometimes it's it's helpful to add it. And we're gonna add a little bit where he's running. And we're just gonna place it wherever we feel like putting it, or we think it might be it might be better. So 
here. It looks like he's in the ground pretty hard. So we're just gonna drag it in, in place. All right, now let's watch it. And back in play. This looks pretty good. Need a little more texture to it. That is how to add a sprite image to Pivot Animator. Please subscribe or like. Thanks for watching.